just pack it into the pouch as it is with the legs pointing downwards. Hello everybody, we are here with the video about upgrades we did to some of our equipment and also we try to bring some useful tips for you. The first upgraded item is this versatile and heavy duty shower. And what we did to upgrade this item, this wood handle all the way here is somehow protected against moisture so it's coated like hardwood floor the shiny stuff but it's very slippery we bought spray can with little pieces inside maybe the camera will catch it as you see it's not smooth but it has texture. Much better to grab it and hold it even with uh, wet hands or something. And uh, also we drilled a hole through the handle so we can put some piece of paracord. We also upgraded the shovel cover or sheet. This is the original setup. And this line was connected over here we just cut it out and installed as you see another useful item gypsy studs if you don't know what it is check our previous video about poncho liner we used it over there and it's extremely useful so we attach this so it can be open put it behind your belt just close and you are done also we add another snap on the end so it can be snapped like that another equipment or tool we upgraded a bit previously we showed you the sheet of uh, the BK2 K bar was basically like this just a loop and nothing else so always when you need to put it behind your belt you have to take your belt out open it and slide it there we added these two mali stripes which you can purchase uh, they are very durable they are rubberized and uh, they come with these two snaps and we just attach them basically behind the loop as you see so you have two options you can have permanent loop or you can have this Mali type attachment another upgrade we did with this sheet we added this uh, fire striker which uh, is hauled hopefully you can see that it's hauled by two wire clamps which you can purchase from any hardware store and it just slides through it like this and you can use it put it back and it's very tight we've been also looking for nice Mali type sheet for the tactical cylinder as you remember we had the uh, pouch which was red and black and definitely didn't match our idea so we found uh, this nice sheet or pouch as you see Mali compatible with two 
pockets on the side and the front pocket with some uh, hooking loop. So nicely fits the tactical cylinder inside. But what we have here on the side is uh, basically upgrade to the stands or legs if you want for the tactical cylinder. Certainly this idea does not replace the previous or the original uh, setup with the screws. They work just fine and uh, have some additional potential. So let me show you how it works. Here is a spring pushing against this uh, washer and here is another type of washer pushing against this metal rod. As you see, this has very thin sides and this rod can be screwed in or out. So if you push this down, it will open and you can take the rod out. Also, you can screw this and as you see, it's climbing up. And now I will install it on the tactical cylinder and show you other, other options. Put the metal star through it, put the spring there, adjust the washer and the second washer, just push against it so it goes through like this and you can just take the metal rod and just put it there and you are done. And now I will do it on another two sides. Certainly the standard way how to set this up is to just turn these down. You can adjust the height by pushing on it so you can make it so you can make it shorter or uneven terrain and you can start with cooking the another option from probably many if you need to have this really secure all it needs to be done push this rod through this hole just like this so it holds there and it's going nowhere so the same here and you have nice rocket style platform and another we think useful tip is uh, using this uh, lip balm um, especially this one with uh, the beeswax um, I am not sure how it works for somebody else but uh, when I cut myself accidentally as you can see here it was deep cut let's say quarter of an inch it was basically bleeding and uh, I couldn't somehow <laughs> stop it uh, just by simple bandage so I used uh, pieces of tape to somehow clamp it together and uh, before I did that I put a lot of this uh, into the gap and close it with it and as you see it's almost healed up basically it's not it's not open anymore and this happened four days ago so it's very very amazing stuff certainly I use it as a lip balm as well but somehow it's working very well on cuts and to seal any basically open wound or something like that but you need to definitely put any bandage over it for sure to keep it close and one of the important upgrades we did is also in a car uh, we installed this kind of uh, metal bar on the back door of FJ Cruiser. We didn't drill any holes, we didn't ruin any plastic, nothing like that. 
it's using the existing holes in the frame and in the in the plastic. You can hang whatever you want. We plan to have specific uh, pouches for food, water, fire, emergency tools. So we definitely will show you the progress. We also purchased these uh, somehow not seat covers but uh, seat mali attachments. As you see, uh, you can add a lot of things to it and they are very durable. We just added a couple things so far. Knife, radio, flashlight and here is some hygiene and the cooker. And another possibly useful item can be pepper spray. You can buy this small version with the attachment. So we just quickly attach it here so when you are driving you have your right hand all the time closer to the pepper spray. Okay everybody, we hope this short video with uh, some upgrades and tips for you was uh, helpful and possibly bring you new ideas for your equipment, how to upgrade it or what to do with it. All links will be added to the description for items or spray cans or perhaps even these pouches. Also other project in progress is the emergency car kit which we are working on and uh, hopefully it will be added in the video about the get out car, that's how we call it. So stay tuned, please subscribe if you like our stuff, you can visit our store, if you like our patches you can purchase one and support us, we will really appreciate it and uh, until the next video Take care guys.